variable benefits and conventional with profit policies a live page at 75 exact purchases a 10 year temporary annuity of an initial amount of 1200 per annum this annuity increases on each policy anniversary by 100 per annum the last increase being at the beginning of the 10th policy year all annuity payments are paid annually in advance. Calculate the expected present value of maturity uh, of the annuity benefits. The basis is uh, mortality M92, interest 6%, expenses nil. So let's do this first. Question 1. What we need is uh, EPV. So EPV is equals to, we have 1100. And we need ADU XN or ADU XN, the value of ADU XN was uh, saved as all shift K in my system. And then this is 75 and this is 10. Okay, 75 and 10 plus, and this is an increasing uh, annuity. So now we need to write IA. Now, see, I haven't taught you all IA, so you all need to know. I A D D dot space space underscore seventy five. I'm just writing seventy five is to ten. Y'all please watch it. Save I A X N in your shortcuts like how you all will uh, have saved other ones. See now this is not ten becoming not properly. This is because I haven't saved it earlier. Now what I have to know? I have to use a brackets. Okay, so when you do it normally, it becomes easier, saves a lot of time. Okay, so I, A, D, U, X, N. And now, all it equals to, we know that we have to calculate. So, this 1100, A, U, 75, 10 is A, D, U, 75. So, A, D, D, dot. Again, I haven't saved all of these. So, that is why I am writing. If you have saved, please use your shortcuts. It saves a lot of time. L65 by L7, L85 by L75, H, okay, and then ADU85, so again I'll copy, paste, shortcut is obviously easier, don't need to go back anywhere, you just insert your shortcut and change it to 85, okay, which is equals to 7.679 minus 1.06 to the power minus 10 into 3385.2479 divided by 6879.1673 into 4.998 which is equals to 6.306. Okay, this is the next step. Uh, just copy this. I did not notice. I am continuing. Okay, what we will do this is. Actually, I was solving this. So, solving this. This value is equals to 6.306. Okay, next is the next part. Increasing annuity part 100 IA due. So let's solve for IA due and then we'll put in the final equation. So IA due is equals to IA again, IA dot. So please, y'all save it. I haven't saved it. I am continuously saying this. That is why I am writing. So please save all of this. How I am writing minus V to the part 10. L85 by L75 you can just copy no need to write again and again the same thing just copy paste every time okay and then in brackets 10 A du 85 so A du X A du 85 plus I A du 85 so we need again I A du 85 the formula remains exactly similar to what we have over here but these portions are small small changes are there and then you can just come down and put the values to this i a d u 85 that is 48.128 minus 1.06 to the power minus 10 and then 
three three eight five. I'm not right again. Into ten into four point nine nine eight minus plus twenty one point five zero three. Okay. So solving this, the value we get is twenty eight point four eight five. When you have this now, EPV is equals to just addition. So eleven hundred into six point three zero six plus hundred into twenty eight point four eight five, which is equals to nine seven eight five point seven two. So these are the values of EPV. Okay. Now coming to the next question, a life insurance company is considering selling with profit endowment policies to lives agent. Uh, with profit policy, the term of twenty years and initial sum assured of hundred thousand. Death benefits are payable at the end of the year of policy death. Bonuses will vent at best at the end of the year. Cons policy company is considering. Three different bonuses structure: simple revenue bonus of four point five, compound revenue bonus of three point eight four six one five percent, and super compound bonus. So the original sum assured is uh, receives a bonus of three percent each year, and all previous bonuses receive an additional bonus of six percent each year. Calculate the amount payable at maturity under the three structures, and calculate the expected uh, present value of benefits under structure two. For an individual age at forty five, exact and using the following basis: the interest, mortality, and expenses. Okay, and then we'll do the calculate the expected value of benefits using the same policy as then, but reflecting, and isn't true but reflecting the following changes: bonuses vest at the start of each policy year, the death benefit is payable immediately on death, and death benefit is payable immediately on death, and bonuses vest continuously. So, big question, doing part by part. So, question two, first part one. Under simple structure, simple bonus. Under simple bonus, we have our value is equals to hundred thousand. Hundred thousand. This doesn't require all equals to. We just have to write normal multiplication zero point zero four five into twenty because bonuses will end. So this is my maturity amount one ninety thousand. Next year for compound bonuses, now we'll require all t equals to hundred thousand into one point zero three eight four six one five to the part twenty, which is equals to two one two seven one nine point eight four. And for part three, all t equals to after twenty super compound bonus. So ten thousand, hundred thousand into hundred thousand plus three thousand, and we need s. So see, I'll write what I'll write all shift b. This gives me a n, but I need what I need s n. So I'll just replace s with this, and this is my twenty. Okay, and then equals to hundred thousand plus three thousand into thirty six point seven eight five six is my value for this, which is equals to two one zero point three uh, two one zero three five six point eight. Okay, so these are the values for super compound bonus. Just write super compound here. So these are the three structures for this. This is not part two. Actually, all all of them is part one. Do not number. Next is part two. Part two is EPV of benefits under structures so two. So EPV of benefits under structure two. So that is equals to 
PPV is equals to alt equals to hundred thousand divided by one point zero three eight four six one five and then we need our term assurance so uh, for my term assurance my pass uh, shortcut is all shift l and then i just need to since this is a select mortality so 45 term is 20 and done this is term assurance so this is equals to alt equals to 100000 divided by 1.0384 Four six one five into zero point zero zero point four six nine eight two minus four six nine eight two minus six eighty nine point two three divided by one six Seven seven point four two. Okay, so solving this, we have five six seven five point zero three. This is EPV, and then EPV of maturity benefit. This EPV of death benefit. You can do it together also. I am doing it uh, separately. EPV of maturity. So for EPV of maturity we have 100,000 into, you now you have to write pure, so for pure it is all shift M, again going 45, 20 is equals to 100,000 into 689.23 divided by 1677.42 which is equals to 41088.70 and don't forget to write evaluating under evaluating at 4% because this is a bonus sum okay we were given the value of 6% but we are using 4% now so do not forget to write now once we do this sum of these two summing EPV is equals to 5675.03 plus 41088.70 gives 46764. Okay, and then comes to part 2, part 3, in fact, part 3a bonuses at this vest at start of your. So if bonuses vest at start of year, what is the change? Then my value will change to all the equals to EPV of death benefit is equals to EPV of just benefit. I'll do directly. If the bonus is vest at the start of the year, hundred thousand, and then we have the endowment assurance. So all shift and directly. I do not have to change there is no extra 20 at the rate of 4 percent okay which is equals to 100,000 into 0 0.46982 so 982 which is equals to 46982 directly then if B bonuses vest death benefit payable immediately on death Re on death so if death payable is immediately on death then we have alt equals to sqrt of 1.08 into 100,000 divided by 1.038 4615 into a45 term so i'm not call see you have to play smart you know this part was there in fact the other part was also there which i have written so this is there we have calculated the value for this you already know the value for this 
सो जस्ट डो नॉट स्टार्ट ऑफ डूइंग अगेन जस्ट मल्टीप्लाई दिस वैल्यू विथ वन द अब वैल्यू विच इज देयर द वैल्यू विच इज यू हैव गॉट इन द दिस स्ट्रक्चर टेन थाउजेंड टर्म सो विच इज फाइव सिक्स सेवन फाइव पॉइंट जीरो थ्री दिस रिमेन सेम ए फोर्टी फाइव ट्वेंटी वन ओनली थिंग यू हैव टू मल्टीप्लाई इज एस क्यू आर टी ऑफ दिस पोर्शन सो कंट्रोल वी इन टू ऑल टीपल्स टू एंड एस क्यू आर टी ऑफ वन पॉइंट जीरो सो कैलकुलेटिंग दिस दिस वैल्यू कम्स टू फाइव एट नाइन सेवन पॉइंट सिक्स सेवन डू नॉट कैलकुलेट द एंटायर थिंग एंड ई पी वी ऑफ मच्योरिटी इज अनचेंज मच्योरिटी विल ऑलवेज रिमेन अनचेंज बिकॉज दैट डन हैपन एनी थिंग टू मच्योरिटी इट इज पेड ओनली एट मच्योरिटी सो देफ टोटल ई पी वी इज इक्वल्स टू फाइव एट नाइन सेवन फोर सिक्स नाइन एट सिक्स ओके एंड पार्ट सी वॉज बोनस इज ऑल्सो वेस्ट कंटिन्यूसली बोनस वेस्ट कंटिन्यूसली so when bonus is vest continuously all t equals to epv is 100000 a bar so all shift n is for my endowment now it becomes immediately on death because everything is being paid continuously okay a bar at the rate 4% this you calculate at the rate 4% so now once you calculate this this becomes 100000 into backslash sqrt of 1.04 this is there and then normal term so all shift l is my normal term where this becomes only 45 and 20 so these are important to write all shift 20 and then pure all shift n uh m is for pure while you work you will remember your shortcut so that will make your work easier i don't remember it currently okay i am also i have it written and i'm referring to that okay so this is there so once you have this you just now put the values 100000 into this is there into 0.46982 minus 689.23 0.46982 Seven seven point four two plus six eighty nine point two three divided. Hundred four six nine eight. Yeah. So therefore, this is equal to four seven zero nine nine. Unsolving. Okay.